Hello cuties, welcome to my channel. to come in with a short clip to let you know how this hair was before I cut it and styled it up so um, yes this hair is like too much hair for me so this is how you'll get it straight out the package kind of like big and wild like this and it's just kind of like everywhere so I am gonna have to do a lot of trimming to this wig um, so I did want you guys to see how it came straight out the package. I didn't finger comb her. I didn't do anything to her. So here is the 360 side. Back. Other side. And front again. Um, this is just a little bit too much hair. For me, in my opinion, um, I tried the flip over method. It's still just a lot of hair. So, um, I'll show you how I style it in the clip to come. So, if you like it, ladies, like this, make sure you just leave your wig as is. But if you want to see how I um, cut it up or what I did, just stay tuned. Alright, talk to you later. Bye-bye. Hey, YouTubers. So, um, happy Thursday to everyone out there. I hope you're having a blessed day. So, as you see in the clip before this one, um, this wig came really big and lots of hair. It was just, it didn't look uh, good to me in my opinion. And let's just talk about this wig that I have on my head. Um, I'm loving it ever since I have shaped it up and made it into my own so this wig is sensational empress lace wig lace front edge um wig this is the style jenna in the color fs 427 so as you see on the picture she comes uh you know kind of tamed and everything and kind of put together but that's not how I received her she is just a lot of hair that just goes everywhere so I will share with you what I did to maintain this look and to um, get the style that I have right now so what I just did I went in with my shears um, I used the biggest side right here and I just kind of took some of that hair it was kind of out here I just kind of took some of that hair and kind of shaved it down um, on each side and even a little bit in the back so once I did that I kind of flipped it over to the side and I cut some layers into her a little bit um, and it was still long and I was like I still don't like it so I'm going to go ahead and just cut some inches off of her so what I did I used um, I used this little rubber band right here and I put a rubber band on each side and I put it to the length that I wanted to cut it make sure that um, each side was um, balanced out and I made sure that I cut it evenly and that's what I did the back was kind of uh, choppy so I went in and I kind of made everything even so that's what I did I will share with you the hair that came out um, in one second. So this wig is curling iron safe up to 325, I'm sorry, 350 to 400 degrees. So I recommend that you go to 325 just so you won't burn your unit and everything like that. So this is 100% premium fibers, which means it's just synthetic. It has nice synthetic fibers that you can curl. Um, so it does say it has a delicate baby hair. Um, I didn't see any baby hairs whatsoever on this wig. So um, if you're going to be looking for baby hairs on this wig, you might not want to get it because it doesn't have baby hairs. Um, it is a perfect fit. It says um, a, a natural hairline, which the hairline is pretty natural. 
you you do get some um dips and curves in the hairline so um yes it has three combs two at each temple one in the back with the adjustable straps the combs are metal combs and they are very very small so you can adjust this wig to however you want it is a medium to small size cap so it does fit perfect on my head so if you do have a bigger head you might just want to leave the latches be and you know kind of leave the wig open so that you, the wig can fit on your head so let's talk about um how much hair i took off of this wig um this is how much hair i took off of this wig quite a bit um it was just too much for me it was overbearing my face and um like i said i do like big hair because um i do have the wig evelyn and that is some big hair but it's kind of shoulder length a little bit longer than this and um it came a little bit more um, put together so um, this wig it was just too out of control for me so this is how much I got um, so all you have to do is just cut some length and just trim to your liking and you know make the wig your own if you don't like it but if you do like it um, how it was before make sure you do pick her up this wig I got from wigtypes.com the wig was about um, 16 to 20 dollars I'll leave the price right here so this is all for this wig one more 360 for you guys front side back other side in front again so um I do like this wig now I would give this wig um, before I style it I would give this wig a 6 out of 10 only because it was just too much hassle I had to put too much work into it but after I kind of made it my own I would give it an 8 out of 10 so yes ladies if you do like this wig thumbs up if you want to try this wig thumbs up like comment and subscribe I'll see you guys later Bye-bye.